What game should I make? A vodka explosive game? Or you can't do that? Time to make a vodka explosive game. How cool would it be if this could be the world map? Markham 3D, the hero of this story, who explained Google Maps to Blender. And as I found my old apartment, we have a city. Time to make a game. So I added the capsule as a player. Whoa, as big as your mother. So I make the city 20 times bigger. Still big, as big as your butthole. So 50 times it is. I need a higher resolution city. And so, for the first time in my life, I read the documentation. And it worked. And so I started walking around for the next hour. Gotta get my 10,000 steps in every day. Try Manhattan. You will never see Manhattan this empty again. Or pixelated. In a vodka game, you have to be drunk, of course. So, using some post-processing, it looks more like you're high than drunk. And so, back to Google. How to be drunk in Unity. And here we have the second hero of the story. Press my Slossoborski. And we're upside down. Lifesaver again. Drunk in Stockholm, just like any Saturday night. I asked on my Discord channel, guys and girls, please tell me the city you are from for my new game. But they're on to me. You want to visit us? Kill us? That escalated quickly. But okay, take Riga. What? No 3D in Riga? So what about Kuwait? Nope, why does Google hate my Discord members? Uh, Scotland. So let's try Edinburgh. Edinburgh works and thus party time. Wow, what a dark city. I need to be drunk for this. Perfect. A vodka explosive game needs, yes, a vodka bottle, of course. And so I started modeling. Hook me up with some bottles. Absolute vodka. I call it Absonoop Vodka. Perfect. I stole this Minions Art free liquid shader and it's just beautiful. Absolute Vodka. I went into the Simpsons zombie game I made because it has this cool explosion. I copied it and here we go, a vodka explosive game. After messing around with some animations, we can now drink for real, which will be reloading. Time to create a happy Marcus for once. And so I started. You don't know who Marcus is? Who was in Balloon Burst, Zombie Manager, The GoldenEye Remake, The Marcus Game Show, Stardew Valley, Dog Game, Pizza Park Room, Minecraft in Space, Crazy Taxi, Hitman, Babushka Battles, Brackies Game Jump, GameStop, Cyberpunk, Mario Kart, Simpsons, Zombies. Never forget Marcus. So I continued modeling and I got this, yeah. You forgetting Marcus has distracted me, I'll start over. By the way, there's apparently a nemesis of Marcus now made by one of the noobs on Discord. It's a bit controversial, but you'll see it at the end. Marcus, indestructible, happy and waving. Marcus needs a water bottle so you can get sober, so I made one. Calm down with that water, Marcus. Drink, drink, drink. Magic water. Marcus water. Now available as tours. Since they've been onto me with my comment, we need something else to kill. So I built this prototype for a drone, but now it's just a cube. So I started modeling an ID from my brain. Drone. I had drones in the Marcus game show. 
so I stole their electric attack and now we have a super scary drone. Now I didn't really like the idea that you have to find water every time you reload. So I coded it so that you automatically get less drunk over time. No more Marcus water, it's bankrupt. I asked one creeper, you normally have good ideas. Wanna test my alpha 00000.00001 game? And tell me what you think. Plane or car. So I started making this prototype and we're flying sideways. Better, but still crap. Flying physics, what? Physics, what? And here we go, finally something decent. Take this drone back to drone hell. And then I spent the next hour flying around being cool. Time to make a model of my new plane. A bit too big. That is what she said. And here we go. Another few hours wasted just flying around. After using some advanced stuff, we now have increasing and decreasing afterburners. I'm also thinking about reusing your DevNoop model. Ha, ha. Make him a collectible. So I stole the model from my old balloon burst project. So now, when I'm casually flying around and I see a collectible, I just jump out and get the collectible. So what have I achieved in my life after 30 years? I'm a collectible! In my own games. Make this beer bottle. Which I did. And now we have an automatic weapon which is also a beer bottle. Mind blown. Say hello to my little friend. I've always wanted to start my own wine company. So I made this bottle. A fancy logo with a fancy scribble. And we have the best weapon ever with the best reload ever. It's the return of the king. Who's the king? You don't know who the king is? Marcus, of course, who was in Star... Haha, <laughs> got you. Not gonna do it again. I put Marcus on the plane, who is very happy to shoot some balls. Balls. Enjoy the view, Marcus. Time for the rest of the cities. London, London. <laughs> Add some magic and it's an FPS in London. Singapore. Another map for my game. Edinburgh. Let's get a better version and whoa, amazing. Kansas City with bar B juice. And of course, we are chilling in Kansas. Now where is the bar B Q? The city of Unity, founded in Copenhagen. And whoa, here we are, where it all started. What? The Principality of Sealand? But it doesn't exist? But this I can make myself. And so, after some messing around and taking textures from 3D jungle, we now have Sealand. Mr. Worldwide. Yeah. I finally made this gorgeous menu. Yeah, let's not look at my menu. Now the gameplay is horrible. It's absolutely beep. But it was one of the funnier projects I've done. Just to walk around and fly around in your own city is awesome. Of course, you can play it for free on itch.io and all the models, cities, scripts are available on GitHub. Subscribe, like, and tell me what to make next. And now, Ruts made a Marcus game. Let's check it out. Don't touch Darkus. Oi! It's like Squid Game Marcus version. Here we go, race to the end. 
Marcus is angry now, Darkus is calm now. Easy. Jumping to victory. Okay. Here we go.